everybody. Hello. Hello. Is Coco your favorite? Not the favorite. We just know who Coco is, of course. And I play Mama, as you know. And we have her sisters. I play Ari. I play Rio. And I play Rich. And I play Coco your favorite. Okay. Not yeah. the, the not the favorite Coco. Okay. Mm, all right. I'm the ready. game we're going to play today is called what? It is called, what is it? Hot, hot takes. Hot takes. Hot, hot takes. Because we're going to talk and discuss about what we think is hot and what is not. Mm-hmm. Mm -hmm. Okay. Good job. Good job. I have a bug on me? No. I just wanted you to <laughs> sit up tall so we can see your face really well. You're okay. beautiful. Face. You're beautiful. Okay. Okay. Yeah, okay so the first yeah. question is, okay, is a hot dog a sandwich? Is yeah. a hot dog a sandwich? Yeah. Okay, so we agree or disagree? Yeah, disagree. so you disagree? What you do? Agree. Agree. Disagree. Agree. I agree. It's a sandwich because I feel like it's a sandwich because you put the meat between the bread and you close it and you eat it. And, you put the and then you put on. sauce on it, like mm -hmm. mayonnaise and ketchup. Mm -hmm. really? Why do you guys think it's not a sandwich? I feel it's not a sandwich because when I think of a sandwich, I think of, you know, like the the layers, the Tradition. the bread, the mayonnaise, the meat, the tomatoes, the lettuce, the pe whatever mushroom, onions, whatever you put on it. But you could put all that on a hot dog, right? Because a hot dog isn't a sandwich. I don't put mayonnaise and tomatoes on my hot dog. <laughs> when I That's used to you. eat, right? I always used to. When I used to eat hot dogs, I put mayo and tomato. I, I put relish, oh. onions, anything that I can fit on my hot dog. I okay, see. let's look up the definition of a hot dog. I mean, of a sandwich. Of a sandwich, okay. I can't. <laughs> oh, dude, I, I say it's not because think back to school and you have hot dog form of your paper folding and then you have hamburger form. It's just it's two different things proven on paper. Okay. Did you get the definition yet? Well, I, I got to type She's it. typing it in. She's typing it in. Okay. Okay. All right. Okay. Oh, uh, so go ahead. Um, <laughs> Caroline, you can go. Okay, sandwich. An item of food consisting of two pieces of bread with meat, cheese, or other filling between them. Eaten as a light meal. It still can go for both. Okay, there's no it right or wrong. Yeah, me. it could go either way. Equal, yeah. equal. Yeah. What do you guys think? Could a, is a hot dog a sandwich? Put it in the comments. Okay, next one. When you make cereal, do you put the milk in the bowl first or the cereal? Hmm. Cereal. cereal. I put the cereal milk. first. I put the milk first. Why is everybody looking at me? Ari does milk. I put, uh, I, I, I put <laughs> the um, I put the cereal for it. Yeah, you're right. Does that make us a serial killer? No. Oh, maybe, you guys are. Maybe I like milk. Bathing the cereal. Why do you put the milk first? I put the milk first because you're going swimming. <laughs> the cereal I, goes swimming in I, the milk. I put the milk first because I feel like. When I put the cereal first, the milk like kind of just overtakes the cereal and gets soggy. Oh, I don't like soggy. Does it mm -hmm. might get soggy? I just throw it out and, <laughs> and I don't tell mom. Okay, mm -hmm. so we waste food. Good to know. Um, yeah, for me, I put I put the cereal first because that helps me measure how much milk I'm actually gonna put in. Cause I don't like I like Ari. I don't like it to overtake my cereal. So. I do put the cereal first, so I'll just put a little less milk or whatever the case may be. So only one person pushed the milk first. Only one person. So Unless other people out there. Four do. people are cereal killers. Not cereal. One, two, Maybe. three. Cereal four. bathers. Cereal bathers. Okay. Okay. Next one. Uh milk with ice or without? Without for me. What? Milk. Some people put ice in their, their milk. Do you all put ice in your milk? I don't drink no. milk. Depending if my milk is Any like type of milk, super like hot. Almond, almond milk, milk, coconut milk, oat milk. It depends. No. Is my milk like super, super hot? Mm -mm. Out the fridge. If it was oh, milk. out the fridge, then no. I have to have ice with my milk. Me too. Because you like it super cold? It just that only tastes right that way to me. I don't it doesn't get watery? Mm -mm. Mm -mm. And then, because cause the milk freezes on the ice, so it like make it like a slushy a little bit on the ice part so it doesn't and then I also like ice in my cereal. Mm. 
I that, can't, I can't I, eat cereal. Is that why I couldn't find no ice in the fridge? Mm-hmm. <laughs> it reminds me too much of school because the school milk, you either get it icy and crunchy or you get it like slimy. You could play with I don't it. drink milk. You can play with milk? <laughs> At school? Okay, yeah. I need to call it principal. All um, right, <laughs> next question. Pregunta. Um, oh, do you brush your teeth? Oh, don't forget to write your answers. Yes, write your answers. Do you brush your teeth before or after breakfast? Before. I do both. Yeah. I do both. When there, when if, if it's just me at home, I'll brush it after. But if I know I'm going to have to communicate with people and I don't want to offend them with my morning breath, then I brush before it really it doesn't because sometimes people don't because it makes your breakfast or whatever you're eating or drinking taste different but it depends on the toothpaste you're using you too and I don't use one that really makes anything taste different oh I mama tells me to brush my teeth as soon as I wake up but a lot of times I don't do that well most of the time well never I always eat my breakfast first because because cause I like my tart breath on my breakfast because it gives it more flavor. <laughs> Anybody else? Me Sorry. personally, the table smells. I, um, I eat my, <laughs> I, I brush my teeth, I, I mean, I eat breakfast, mm-hmm. then I brush my teeth. Okay. Because, so then when I go out. Oh, smell. you like stinky breath too for breakfast. Because <laughs> the tart, the tart flavor No, that's tastes not better. why. I don't want to have stinky breath at school and have them kids yeah. talk about me. Oh. It helps if you rinse with peroxide too, but only if you know how to rinse properly. Yeah, don't do that mm-hmm. if you're under ten, please. Yeah, don't, don't. But yeah, that helps with the the all day breath. What about you, Ma? RJ um, said he brushes his voice. Okay. I mean, mm-hmm. Rich. What's your name again? Rich. Rich. <laughs> Rich. It, it depends on the day, cause like when I have a busy morning, I won't have breakfast, so I just brush my teeth like right before I leave, but. I don't know. It depends. Do you eat at school then? Sometimes. Um, okay. Sometimes I just don't brush my teeth. <laughs> Throughout the day ever? Okay. We'll talk about that later. Yeah. Because that's, uh, cool, cool. Please don't do that at home. Um, brush your teeth. Brush your teeth. It's good for your, your, it's for your um, hygienic health. Brushing the teeth is so much fun. Okay, here we go. <laughs> okay. Let's see. For my chicken eaters out there who eat the cluck, cluck, clucks. Um, do you prefer flats or drumsticks? Good question. The flats are the ones that are flat. Mm-hmm. They're just a wing. Just the wing. It's just a wing like this. Okay. okay. Or do you prefer the the drumstick? Yeah, the drumstick. It's yeah, it's like it's like the drum, the leg. Yeah, a mini leg. Yeah. Um, right. when I used to eat chicken, I preferred flats. Why do you prefer flats? Cause you just like you take the bones out. Put it in the sauce, it's good. Oh, I've never tried it that way. Oh. <laughs> mm-hmm. This is new. No, I'm, I mean, I don't eat chicken anymore, but I kind of wish I did so I could try it that way. Mm-hmm. I only prefer it the flats because I feel like the drumsticks had more of that chewy mm-hmm. meat on it. I did not. If I get a piece of chewy meat in my chicken while I'm chewing, I don't want it anymore. So I feel like the flats have less of that chewy, what is that, like the gristle fat type stuff on it. Mm-hmm. I, I like the flats when I used to eat sh- chickens. Um, because the flats made my back feel flat. What 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 about you, Ari? Wait, I'm not done yet. Oh, I'm sorry. I thought you. I you... like the flats more because it seemed like they just taste better. Because the drumsticks, they had like fat. They fat. They're fat. Mm-hmm. They're thick, and I don't, I don't like thick meat. I like the flat. Okay, that's that's a good point. Thanks, Mama. What about you, Ari? I don't really understand the question, but me personally, I just pick up any piece of chicken that I want. She <laughs> like, okay, and some people don't have a preference. That's fine. That's fine. Did you say yours, Rhea? I don't like chicken, but like if if I do eat it, I'll take the flat, but I'll take all the meat off the bones and dip it. In the oh, you do it like rich. Mm-hmm. It's good to know. It's good to know. I'm learning something new every day. Okay. Good job, guys. Keep eating your sh- chicken. <laughs> All right, next question. Should children, kiddos, be able to have their phones in class? Yes. Doo, doo, doo. <laughs> this is a, this could go either way. I feel like they, mm, 
Okay, um, I feel like that can go either way. I feel like nowadays they should have their phones in case of an emergency because a lot of things are happening in the world now. Mm -hmm. um, do I feel like they should be on their phones in class? Absolutely not. And I feel like that's a policy that needs to be in place. I feel like kids should have their phones in class. Like, I don't know. I know some schools have like a little baggie for their phones and they hook it onto their pants. Or like their neck, or like their, I forgot it's called, like their key card. And I feel like they should have it just in case their parents call because half the time kids don't even let you call your parents in class. So half the time you might throw up, something might happen, you want to call your parents, call your parents. But if you want to be on your phone, like, otherwise, if you want to watch TikTok or something, you should wait till lunch or something to do that. Otherwise, just be on your phone when you need your calculator. They have calculators. <laughs> or just have a calculator, okay. a separate calculator. Okay. I feel like, um, I think that the real answer is it should not be phones in class because what do we as kids need phones in class for if they could just call the teachers or the office? But that's just the answer you want to hear. My real answer is, of course we should have our phones in class. I got people to talk to, people to call. Like, Ooh. And like everybody and then like a lot of times i'm in class and i want to talk to mama and mama's not even neil mm -hmm. so of course work. yeah but mama if i want to call you i should be able to call you on your lunch or in case of an emergency because like you're at school i'm at work i feel like we should boycott elementary students don't need their phones we ooh. protest we want a phone we, we want, want a phone okay. all right all right okay. what, Rich, what do you think i need my phone <laughs> Because I get done with my work quick, and I'm just sitting there bored. I need a phone. Just be on my phone, watch the TikTok, play the game. But you also have a computer for that, like Chromebooks and stuff. But we can't. It's, not it's restricted. Not we can't everything. do nothing on it. Depends not on the school system, probably, too. Yeah. Okay. Next okay, question. next question. Uh, this is a question from Mama. She's been concerned because we like to wear beanies like that in, in the summertime. But I guess they made for the winter, according to the adults. So, should beanies be worn in the summertime? For me, I, I don't see the reason. Because, you know, it's like 80 or 90 degrees outside and the winter hat is being worn in the summer. Is your head not sweaty? Is is does it itch? What what is what is happening? I have a cold head. In mm -hmm. in eighty degree weather, Mama, oh. it's for style. For style? Yes. Look how cool Rich looks. Pretty cool. That's <laughs> warm. It don't matter. Mm -hmm. It really don't. If you want to wear your beanie in the winter, go ahead. It's the summer. We if you want to wear it in the the spring, the fall, the fall, the chicken nuggets, go ahead. It's a beanie. You're going to look cute either way. You okay, play. last question. Because I always get a little crazy. <laughs> <laughs> All right, this is the last and final question, guys. Make sure you write your answers in the board, at the bottom. Right now. Cats or dogs? Dogs. Hmm. Dogs. Do dogs. Cats. Cat dog. You love dogs. What do you mean? I like cats more. Okay. Um, but no, that's cool. I like them both, but I like I like dogs' un undying affection and love. Like cats are like, I like you today, but don't look at me too much or I might scratch you. So I like cat dogs, dogs like... when they connected. A cat? <laughs> Have you seen a cat dog? dog in real life? Yeah, I'm gonna get one. Oh, where were you gonna keep it? A uh, cat dog. Cat dog. <laughs> I don't like cats because one time a cat put their nails into my chest and it hurt really, really badly. So I will never like a cat ever again. I'm sorry that you've been traumatized. <laughs> I'm sorry that happened to you too. So that's understandable. But I think some some cats are do have really nice personalities. You guys be nice to each other for your is, on punishment for a month. Is um, Ari a cat? Because I feel like her... I feel like her toenails sometimes are real long. I don't know. Coco. Oh. She's not wrong. Am I supposed to not like her either? And you're not supposed to say anything but she's, about But she said she didn't like cats anymore because they she, put their claws on. She put her claws in me one time when she was sleeping. She's not a cat. She's not a cat. Beats, apologize to your sister for telling all the people things that are not true. Apologize. 
fine. Y'all, I'm fine. All right, y'all, put it in the comments. Do you prefer a cat or dog? I, I could go either way, but if I had to choose, I would choose a dog. Mm -hmm. And that's all, folks. Thank you for joining us. Make sure you check out the episode that Rich is in. Season 3, episode... Which we'll call 70 something but what he's gonna be in there okay <laughs> so make sure you check it out see what it's about we love you guys from the coco just being coco family peace peace, peace. now now coco you know that's a no-no every time we turn our heads you're always into trouble with pretty pigtails and a smile that makes us giggle what can we say